Hello and welcome back to Good King Rene. I have created a backup of this save at this exact moment, so what are we going to do? We're going to declare war on the Ottomans after this war is over. Basically, what I wanted to do was attempt to actually get the achievement. Because right now, we haven't... I mean, we attempted, but we were just waiting for an opportunity that hasn't really arisen. That's the problem. I think, actually, for this achievement, what you have to do is you have to be really, really early... Like, either, like, I think you need land on, in Africa, to start with. You, like, you need to get in northern Africa. Like, forget everything in Europe. You want to migrate to Tunis. Like, you want to, like, day one, uh, alliance with France, war in Tunis, bring France in. That sort of thing. Then, once you've got the land in Tunis, you want to slowly eat them while expanding your European holdings. And then, eventually, you can move along the coast to the Mamluks, and then you can take the land at your leisure. The problem was, what we did is we secured our European holdings first, which was good, right? It's really good for making us a strong Provence. However, what it then did is it meant that Tunis allied with the... I think they allied with the Ottomans for a long time. They might still be allied with the Ottomans, yeah. Morocco managed to beat Portugal and Castile for a while, which was just awful. So they were actually strong, and I think they were also allied to the Ottomans for a long time. And then we just never... Act, like, And the Mamluks have a navy large enough that meant that we couldn't actually declare war directly on them. Because if we declared war directly on the Mamluks, we wouldn't have been able to get over there because we had no way through. Maybe actually the best time to declare the war was that small period where we had France as an ally and the Ottomans friendly. Get the military access through the Ottomans, uh, bring France in and just walk around. If a no CB war? Maybe. I I'm not sure. That might have worked. What might also have worked is... Uh, I keep forgetting how to close that every time I reload the game. Um, but what might have worked is not going colonizing, which some people have said. Some people said they think colonizing was probably bad. I think for the achievement, yes. I think for our personal strength, I think it's fantastic because it's actually a, it's going to start making us huge amounts of cash. Like if this was a full like, if this um, achievement goes all the way to the end of the game, this is easy because we we're starting to get colonial cash. We then turn that cash into a good army. We can then turn that good army into a way to beat the Ottomans. But, anyway. I'm going to unpause now. Where's our army? Out of curiosity. After saying, like, talk about good army. Oh yeah, we're hiding in Brittany. That's a very sensible plan. Just going to do this at speed 5. If it looks like they're coming over, I'll slow things down. But that's fine. Ooh, incorruptible. That's alright. Minus corruption. That's not a bad trait, which I think definitely endears it to me. Um, I don't really want to head over here. This seems really bad. Uh, that's a lot of new, of new discoveries. Yeah, we don't really want to join in. We want to let our manpower recover, really. I mean, as much as I hate it, France has to lose. Uh, Bohemia? Yeah, sure, we'll get that royal marriage. That seems fine. We've got a new queen consort. Um, do we have all of our royal marriages secured? Um, I mean, all three? Yeah, I guess we do. Uh, to Totnak over here. Um, we can't vassalize them yet, right? No. Oh, well, could probably because we don't haven't had them for long enough. Um, yeah, we could soon. I think we want to get um these guys soon. We want to get the um, however you pronounce that. I think that's going to work very well. Uh, war exhaustion is high. Yeah, that's because we're never not at war. I'm just seeing like who else we can prove opinion with. I guess Tunis, but we're going to break that alliance, probably. So, actually, maybe we want to raise relations with somebody who we're going to grab an alliance with at the last second. Crimea hate us. Unfortunately, they'd be quite good. Commonwealth, I actually kind of want an opinion with, but the problem is they feel that we are a rival. So that's not going to work. Hmm. Anybody down here... And the Timurids are alright. No guy's probably really strong. Like, they're they're probably massive. Do they want to join in our wars? Probably not. Like, I don't know. They're, they're better than, they're, than the rest. I'm going to improve relations with them. Just on the off chance that we can potentially get an alliance. Like, if we separate from Tunis. That's fine. We could easily separate from Tunis as well. It's not like it's a huge thing to separate from them. Uh, do we want to head down south? Probably not. I think we're alright. Yeah. Um, 
they've come under occupation. That's fine. Like, I'm not worried about that at all. We, we have no control over that side of the map. So, yep. Um, let's see. We could build things. I suppose we do have money, don't we? Hmm. Maybe I'm going to build up here, just where we're not going to get conquered. I'm not sure if you can build when in somewhere that's actually been taken. But given we're raising base tax up here, let's just get some... Ch let's, let's do some churches. Yeah. Let's just um, build a lot of churches. That will hopefully scale quite well. And it's something to do with all of our cash, basically. Yeah. We'll see. We'll see. Okay, so we could potentially beat that army, although they do have a really good leader, so maybe not. Uh, naval forces, that gets us Diplotech down. I'm not too happy about that. Or Diplotech up. Oh. I don't like paying more, but I guess we're going to pay more because, well, really, what else are we using the cash for? Yeah, I guess so. England are declaring wars. Don't really care. Um, we're getting there. This is probably a good time to get this one, right? Yeah, pretty much. We've got 20% uh, down on it because we got that 10% plus we already had 10%. Yeah, that works. I'll take that for, uh, you know, pretty much free. Uh, ooh, convert a uh, province. Lothringia. Let's convert that. I think we've already converted Lothringia, actually. Like before, but I guess we can do it again. Yeah. We're going to get trade efficiency next one, which is going to be fantastic. That's really going to help. Saxony joined Austria's war again. All right, so are they on Austria's side? Yeah, I guess they just got an alliance. Or maybe they, uh, they probably had an alliance, and then they just got to the point where they'd accept. Yeah, fair enough. Fair enough. Uh, I'll take, oh, what are we at? Four, 402 and it's 400 available. Okay. Platinum, it. oh, I'm, I don't care. Uh, Tuscan Succession War. Yeah, that's fine, that doesn't matter. Um, we'll invest in new technology, we'll go Diplotech, fantastic. We got our trade efficiency increased. Means we should make more money now. When that takes over. Yeah, we're making four more, and we got gold in the province, which is alright, although it will raise our inflation naturally, which I kind of dislike that that's doing that. Um, yeah, we'll see next month how much it raises it by. Oh, I guess it doesn't raise it by anything. Hmm. Okay. I guess it's because we don't have a reliance on gold mines, maybe? I don't know. Like, maybe it's because it's a percentage thing? Oh my god, what did you do, Tunis? That's, that's awful. Is this because of the Ottomans? That is 100% because of the Ottomans. That's actually amazing for us, if we can get that war going. That's actually amazing. Okay. We need um, some manpower. We need also for us to just get this war over with. Looks like France aren't doing that badly, which is probably because most of the defending's in mountains, so... That's fairly good. Tobacco? Okay. Uh, doesn't really matter to me, actually. What, whatever our trade good is. Okay. Um, is this because we also control Tuscany, so therefore have the war, war goal? Yeah. Fantastic. So, actually, if we can just... If they've got medium enthusiasm, all we have to do is keep the war going until we get to 10%. Ah, they got high enthusiasm again for some reason. Now they're back down to medium. It must be because of war... Um, yeah, it must be because of war enthusiasm. I'm going to send ourselves down here. Just, um, like, you know, poking for an opportunity. We call our diplomat and uh, no guy. How are you feeling about that alliance? Allied to Novgorod, huh? I could get rid of that alliance with Novgorod. What do we lose for... I could ditch it. I'm not too attached to it. Let's ditch it. I like our... Wait, that said that they, they broke their alliance with us. No, no. We, we broke it with them. I'll take that alliance there, no guy. Fantastic. So that now gives us another potential uh, helper against the Ottomans. Although they would also say no because we don't owe them 10 favors and they're 1,000 in debt. But, you know, it's another potential one against the Ottomans. I didn't say it's another one against the Ottomans. That'd be far too optimistic. Oh, that... Wait... Um, Saxony peaced out of France. That's nice. That's really nice. Uh, that's money for us as well. We want to just head over here, secure our provinces, I think. 
I don't want to take attrition. No, get out of here. Get out of here. No, no attrition. Yeah. We were going in there when we weren't taking attrition. Looks like the Commonwealth aren't actually that interested in the war, which is why we're doing well. Uh, university, that's 35% more. You know what we should do? We should upgrade all of these with extra um, base tax where we can. Just because this is now our little base tax center. Uh, let's go for, yeah, let's go for, oh, I don't want to decrease it. Let's go for another pass. There we go. Uh, that'll work. Um, can we get another one here? If I do that, yes, we can. Fantastic. Right. We're, we're kind of maxed out in base tax over there, but it's really going to work out for us long term, I think. Even though there isn't that much long term left, but, you know, long term. I still think it's the right, it's the right call to uh, put our remaining admin points into that, basically. Don't stand on top of me, Harrigan. Oh, no. Uh, we need to just get into France's territory. It's the only place that actually has enough supply limit for us. Um, trying to find a way through. Like, up here. I don't really want to. You want to peace out? Nah. Uh, we'll, we'll stay in this province. We should have enough to be fine, even if Aragon decides to come walk over here. Uh, love that. Ooh, we got 25 prestige. That's fantastic. Uh, oh, that's because of our offensive uh, ideas. That's actually amazing. Like that, That's really good, that offensive ideas gives you that, like, event. It's crazy good. Oh, low enthusiasm. They would peace out with us for nothing. I think France is probably going to peace out, though. So we're good, I think. Um, is that because the Ottomans are at war with the Commonwealth? They're not War of the Commonwealth. Okay, that's good. We really need France in the War of the Ottomans. That's the problem. France, um, it'd be nice if you could say, I'm going to peace out in this many months. You've got to do something. France's enthusiasm is only medium. I'd say they should take this peace. We'll see, though. Oh, I thought that was a peace. That would have been really good if that was one. Uh, yeah, you can have military access. That's fine. We're almost at positive manpower. Uh, protect our trade. Or don't. They love us. Uh, times of needs. Men for army. Every time men for army. Is the only option, right? Uh, Sienna gave us a thousand manpower. Nice. That's really good. So now we actually have enough to hit max on our army. Fantastic. We are positive manpower. Um, right. Head along here. I hate it when the other armies walk into attrition. Like through you. It's really annoying. Um, oh, I can now convert Mets. Nice. That works for me. I do want to beat up that army, so I'm going to go in and fight it. Because it's about to take one of our provinces, so I feel it's worth it. Oh, wow. We're taking some serious losses. In fact, we might lose. We did lose. My god. And we lost most of our army. Oh, okay. They had a lot in the uh, fog of war, apparently. Okay. Well, that's not ideal. We have suffered casualties. Oh, do you, don't, you don't say. You don't say. What's our mission right now? Oh, turn this thing into a city. Yeah, we're probably going to succeed on that. Tuscan Succession War is over. Nice. Okay, so um, they lost a lot more than we did. Null all treaties with the Commonwealth. Gain money. We now have favors. Look, we, we got to do it, okay? France are in. France are actually in. They're just like... Hell yeah. I'm, I'm in. We can do this. Nah, they don't want land. Yeah, we're... We have to do this. No cast spelly. They're allied with Tunis. Tunis aren't going to join in. So it's just the ultimate. This is by far the best opportunity we're ever going to have. Yeah. By far. Oh, we also have to get Defender of the Faith, right? Because that's so worth it. Yeah. 
right now, that's just amazing. Okay. Then what we want to do is we want to just have a quick look at our army. We can support another 20, so... Um... Yeah, let's do it here. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 of those. 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's a lot of cash we're spending, but I think it's worth it. It's um, non-manpower, um, like, troops, which I think is always good. Okay. Where is the Ottoman? There's the Ottoman's navy. It's fighting against Castile's navy right now. Uh, I think we want to break off ours and bring it in. Our navy, by the way, bigger than Castile's. Just a small point of order. Yeah, you head up to Luca. Right. Um, we definitely want to try and fight over here. Let's we'll see what we can do, though. Um, get that army well connected. You stay where you wait. You stay where you are. There we are. Uh, Sienna, our royal marriage ended. Oh, that's fine. I'll grab another one. Uh, dynastic actions, royal marriage. There we go. Nice. France, they're in. Okay. I'm not sure if we want to fight the Ottoman fleet, but I definitely think we want to think about fighting the Ottoman Wait, where is the Ottoman fleet? Did it lose? It lost to Castile's fleet. Yeah, because there's no... There's no... Fog of War unless they're here. That's fantastic. Let's get to their capital. Yeah. Okay, okay. How many months do we have? We have... 43 months. That's not really long enough. Uh, ha 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 ha, that's what... Yeah, okay, that joke. That joke's well done by now. Let's just leave that alone. Right, um... Yeah, head along this way. There's some Ottoman troops. Just beat them up. We want them to die in as many numbers as possible. Okay. That's real good for us. That's amazing. That's like really good. Because that's just a lot of troops that they no longer have. Although we took a lot of casualties as well. But we took more casualties. We did fight, uh, they, they, we did fight them back. Okay. We have more troops. And yeah. Well, we have more infantry. We don't have more troops overall. They probably have a better army comp- Oh my god, that's- that's huge. Oh my god. Um... Well, this isn't good. We are getting Tuscany joining in, but that's like just throwing more men on- on this trash pile. Okay. Well, we get to run away through Tuscany, which is alright. Um... Our colony is self-sustaining, which means that we finished our mission. Fantastic. Uh, next one, go. New mission. Uh, take one, cancel it. There we go. Uh, any policies that are good here? Mm. Vassal force limit contribution could be alright. Because what it would do is it would give us more troops that we can potentially throw into our army. Yeah, because it's going to give us a larger force limit so we can go over that more easily. Um, yeah, I think we take it. That now puts us up to 88 force limit. We've got another 20 slots free. Oh, clicked off the screen. Don't worry about that. Right. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Do the same again. This is a full infantry army. It's just going to be a reinforcement army, basically. Right. Um, Head up this way. You, this, this army should be reinforcing the whole time. Did we lose our... Oh my god, we lost the fight. That's not good. Uh, at least we have ports on this side. I thought that our navy was stronger than uh, Ottomans. Apparently I clicked off the screen again. Well, that's not very good. Um, Continue merging up. How is everyone else doing this? We've had a few... We have a few blockades that are successful. But battles, not so much. Okay, France is getting hammered. The other option is, the other option is, like, instead of going down here and sieging this land, what if 
Because we might not be able to get down there, but can we get them to release? I'm just seeing if there's a nation. If we can work that out. Um, which nation would it be? Wait, can I click it? Uh, yeah, that's only going to go single province. Um, yeah, obviously not that one. Not that one. Too far down, too far up. Razman, no. Serbia, obviously not. Charmar, no. Sauron? No. If it's Syria, we're screwed, but I don't think it is. It might be Syria. Uh, yeah, it's not those ones. It's not Ardlan. It's obviously not Bulgaria. I think it's Syria. That's unfortunate. Yeah, I think in Syria it's going to be there. So my plan was potentially we could really get them to release a nation that holds that land, and therefore we could then uh, no CB war that nation. But uh, we can't do that. Which does mean we have to get over there and siege, which is the main problem. Uh, split in half. One nation down there. One nation, one army down there. The other one, which is most of the actual army right now, is going to go ahead. Do we have no way up here? No, oh, I must have clicked on Burgundy before. Uh, colony became self-sustaining. That's all right. Excellent. Where is that? Uh, crusade happened to us. That's fantastic. Look at that. Um, so, uh, this one, I guess, we want to go up one. Perfect. We're really uh, growing our little vassal here, which is good. Um, right, back this way. Yeah, we took attrition doing exactly what I said I disliked. Uh, the AI doing to me. Yeah, I get it. We're taking, we're, we're paying so much. Um, I should detach mercenaries, consolidate them. I should do the same here. This is all mercenaries, huh? No? Um, why can't I? Oh, maybe I can't do it till they're there. Yeah. Detach, consolidate, merge. The reason I want to do that is because, um, like, the more regiments of mercenaries, the more they cost us. So, I don't want to be high on regiments. I want to be high on uh, men. Okay. Looks like they're being chased out of France, which is definitely good. Um, yeah. We kind of want to follow. Wait, do we not have military access through where they have military access? Oh, they're maybe they're shattered retreating. Yeah, that's possible. Or maybe they walk through like... Oh, we can't go through anywhere. Ah, we can go through Austria. There we go. We'll head back this way. Yeah, we had to take out a loan. But we're only losing nine a, well, 13 a month. That's actually pretty high, but that's fine. Basically, just have to leave this army down here to die forever. Colony became self-sustaining. Nice. Okay, so we create our wall. Uh, no colonists to send. There we go. Provincial Mexico now exists. Right. Do we now have another vassal down there? Free advisor slot. Hmm. What's our land maintenance modifier right now? It's actually 40%. Uh, it's, uh, sorry, 40 we lose 10% of that, that is 4. That doesn't pay for itself at all. Reinforce speed could be good. But that's only going to... I think that's what moves manpower into your army. So that's, that's not actually going to work. Yeah. So I think I want discipline. I do want one of them. So that much is just certain. Um... I'm just looking for Ottoman's troops right now. See if we can find any. There are some troops. Okay, okay. There's stuff we could potentially do here. Um. Ah, oh, I guess we don't have military access, but they have military access. Maybe I misunderstand how this works. It's understood. Um, right, head over here. A 40,000 man army. Well, 45,000 man army. Let's start using it. Uh, domestic trade power went down. I actually do care quite a lot that domestic trade power went down. Um, 
How many troops do they have? 115k. Same as us. Wow. We're actually incredibly evenly matched, except for the fact that they probably have manpower. Like if I go check the uh, Ottomans, they have, they actually almost don't have any manpower, same as us. Wow. Okay. Uh, how's their other war going? I assume that we're helping. Uh, it's only against Venice, Cyprus, and Ulm now. Uh, Castillo, you decide you just didn't want that war? Oh, alright then. Um, that's unfortunate. Do we want to siege this back? For Venice? I don't really care. I guess, yeah. Well, maybe not. Maybe we'll let Venice siege that back. And we'll just follow behind. Yeah, we probably want to start getting into the Ottomans now. Okay. Just spy on him a little bit. Um, wait, sorry. Use the fleet? How, what do you mean? Oh yeah, we can sit here. That's good. Military access for Milan. Sure. Create a proper fleet. Oh yeah, because we don't have a fleet anymore. I guess we'll take it. That's fine. We're taking so much attrition. It's just awful. We are still getting men back. That's the weird thing with the amount of attrition we're taking. Um, the reason we're getting men back is because they're mercenaries, I think. So actually we get a huge amount of um, men back. Because, yeah. We, it's basically money is our limiter there. Uh, this is fine. If we can start getting some of these forts down, we can start definitely moving into the Ottoman. I just... Am I able to say, like, I just want these provinces? Yeah, I'm able to say it, but they'll say you need to hold a fort in the area. Oh, well. That's unfortunate. Um, we might beat the Ottomans, but I feel it's unlikely we're going to hit this in two years. So, uh, military tech, we'll take that one, definitely. Cavalry shock there. Um, I think we take that as well. Yeah, we just take both of them. That's that's good. Uh, so we're probably at the same tech as the Ottomans now. Yeah, we're at the same tech. So we're probably going to win the war. But we're not going to get anything we want out of it. So I'm not sure what we're going to do. Kind of weird. Hey, if you come for France, I'm, I'm going to get you. That's, that's all I'm saying. Um... We'll just maintain that diplomat. That's fine. They're they're leaving down here, which probably means there's a really big army down there. Uh, Aragon is threatening our trade, which is fine. Not too worried. Ottomans took forty thousand men over there, which is just comical. Okay. Um, let's have a look here. In terms of numbers, they have more. Right now, ours are probably slightly better positioned, but they have more. Okay, we're about... Oh my god, I thought we had that fort. I was very happy there for a second. Uh, we can purchase one last Age of Reformation ability. We get 19 months of this ability. Mercenary Discipline, 100%. It's the only one that makes even... Oh, yeah. Well, that was going to happen, wasn't it? Uh, that's fine. Yeah, it's the only one that makes a, the tiniest amount of sense. Okay, in here... No, you head down this way. You head in there. That's fine. Oh my god, that's a large army. Just uh, chill, chill, chill yourself a second. Oh, we want to keep walking, yeah. 52,000. Do we want to fight? Probably not, because their leader is actually good. We could roll a military leader a couple times, might be worth it. We do actually have the power projection to keep in, like another leader, so. Let's roll another military leader. Five maneuver? Um, I mean, yeah, we'll take him because it means we take less attrition. <laughs> it's, it's like identical apart from the maneuver. <laughs> okay. You catching that army? 5th of September, 8th of September. No. But you are committed to walking in there. If they bring men down, we're in trouble. I, I'm not feeling the battle. Right. Oh, we can fight here. Oh, I'm not feeling that at all, actually. 
Okay, they're locked in. We can head this way and just leave. I think might be our most sensible plan. This is their full army, right? Yeah, that's their full army. Where's ours? In France. Alright. Um, let me head down here and just start sieging. Yeah. Is Ragusa not our fort? Ragusa might be a fort. Maybe it's because there's another... Ah, uh, it's probably this one's blocking our movement into Ragusa. Um, we could head down to Corfu. Let's head down to Corfu. It's probably quite a safe one to siege. So, let's, let's see if we can get it. Um, yeah. It's going to work very well. I think. Mm, okay, 16 months. Uh, so they've decided they're going to siege Corfu, as in France has decided. Because presumably Corfu just sounded like a good idea at the time. Um, we could head down here. There's no way to that fort. Okay. Um, is this a fort? I don't think this is a fort. No. Okay. So, let's head down here and siege this one. Yeah, I think that's probably our way to go. Ultimates are going to block us. 100%. I'm going to get so blocked. Oh, no. Wait, it's it's not a straight. Oh, we're good then. Yeah. Uh, Ultimates now control Maros. That's fine. We have loans to repay and money disappearing quickly. That's also fine. Um, yeah, let's see. That's all generally alright. Our manpower is trash, but our manpower is always going to be trash right now. How many loans are we allowed to take out? Uh, 48. We currently have two. We're okay then. Right now, we're fine. Things get really bad in terms of money, then we might not be fine. That's fine. Um, we have a papal controller in who, uh, like, France control, which is fine. Like, that's alright. Um, but I think it doesn't matter because we already had a crusade against the Ottomans. You're, he you're heading down this way. So you're heading for a fight with me. You're still heading there, so that's the 13th you're going to leave. I don't want that fight. That fight looks... Absolutely trash. Yeah. They they want to we want them to fight us down here. Although they are gonna get the favorable territory, which is unfortunate. Burgundy has embraced global trade. What's the territory? It's Highlands. <sighs> There's not much more we could do apart from maybe dumping some more stuff in here. Hmm. Okay. We could try and just see what we get. Get between four and ten bips as a as base. Plus one plus one. It's a shock and fire will be plus ones. What's what's their leader? Their leader is a three four. There's a chance it's good. 3-3 is not bad. 4-2 is better. I think we commit another leader. Oh, how much is he going to get? He's going to get between 3 and 10. Well, we can have another one without using anything. 5-2 is by far our best. But we're in hostile territory, so what am I even thinking? Um, Yeah, we just have to take the fight. We do start with a lot more morale. That much is good. Okay. There's a negative one penalty to us. Okay. The morale being high is about all we have. Like, that's our only positive. And slightly more cav. A Alliance with the Netherlands. Okay. Or this is not our war. Do we want an alliance with the Netherlands? I mean, sure, I'll take the Alliance of the Netherlands, as long as, I mean, might mean we're in a war with Burgundy, but whatever. Oh, we're losing so many men here. 
This is not good for us. Netherlands got a claim on all of our provinces. That's fine. Um, we might actually have won that if they don't have 13,000 coming in here. Uh, Luna's ours? Yeah. Well, that's not good. Um... Portugal has our new... Has somebody's... I think it was our new rival. I could be wrong, though. No. Uh, I didn't really read that because I was more watching us die in horrible pain and misery. Okay, come fight me. Yeah, I didn't think you would. Okay, at least we have good reinforcement. Oh, France has disputed uh, succession. And we do actually have more prestige. So there is a... Like, we could just go... Um, flame throne. Wait, we don't have a royal marriage? Oh, royal marriage that. Take the main? Is there even a chance? I'm not sure there is a chance, but let's have a look here. April. And we're also going to find out about the age of absolution. I think I'm going to keep the uh, episode going till we find out about that. You'd have to win the Cassis Belly. That's the problem. Like, we'd have to win the war. I'm going for this fight. I think it's probably a good... F it's, it's not a good fight, but it's probably a, an alright fight. Sure, you can have military access. Go for it. It's 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 just good enough a fight. Okay. We are going to get hit, but I think that's fine. Oh, we should have changed leader. We wouldn't have won the fight if we had changed leader, but, you know, we should have changed leader. Uh, we got destroyed. Yep. Yeah. Which leader, if you could? Nope. That's fine. We have lost that heavily. Yeah. Yeah, good, goodbye army. Well, at least we're making money again. Pull six. Wait, is that... That is our entire army, right? Oh, yeah, we just have zero. That's fine. Uh, I'm basically just going to keep it going to see if we can get the Age of Absolution uh, to trigger so we know whether or not we, like... I think that was probably our best chance to, like, get, like, what we wanted out of this. It was our best chance to get the provinces. Um, at least in the time limit. So, we'll see. We'll see. Um, that's a lot of rebels. I am going to reload the save no matter what, though, because we committed everything to it. So, I feel like that's about where we're at. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Yeah, let's see what we got. Age of Reformation in two months. We're expecting an event. Age of Absolution, right. So, governments rest control, absolute power from other parties. They are now to devote themselves to the building of empires. The stage of state rulers of their armies enables the absolution mechanics. Okay, so all of this stuff happens. That's fine. Um, that's all very good. Have a land force limit of at least... Oh, do we qualify for any of those? We already are part of a religious... Oh, be part of the Victoria side in the Religious League War. Wait. Oh, there was already a Religious League War. Yeah. Wait, was there? I don't know. I don't. I don't remember. Uh, but apparently, we succeeded that one. Have five different promoted cultures. We should succeed in instantly, so we could start an instant golden era. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Yeah. Huh. Okay. Uh, and let's check our decisions, huh? They were right. We do not have get the uh, Kingdom of Jerusalem. That's really annoying because it's not a condition on the um, on the decision when you look at it. And not mentioned on the wiki. Very weird. But it's not there. Uh, I, I think it got replaced with uh, Restore the, Ho uh, the Roman Empire because we I don't think we had that beforehand. I could be wrong. I don't think we had that. So if I just wait a couple months... Just seeing if it gives us, like, an event about that. No, it doesn't. Okay. That's fine. We, uh... Hmm. Okay. Interesting. So we don't get that one. Anyway, uh, I'm going to end the episode here, I think. Let's just see what they, they offered us. We'll give a core... Hey, duck. That's actually a really tame peace deal. But it's because we only have 17 and they want out. We'll just decline that because uh, we can. Anyway, thank you for watching. This was a little bit of a what-if episode, as in... What if we did this war and, you know... What if we tried to get it from the Ottomans? It's just not feasible. Like, that just cannot be done in that time frame. Um, unless we had the ships. If we had the ships, we could potentially have trapped... Here's the problem, right, with the ship plan. 
If we had the ships, we could potentially trap the Ottoman army. But the problem is from usually, like if you're playing Byzantines, right? You would sit down here and then you would block off the Ottomans from coming across. You'd siege their land, you'd get ticking war score and eventually that's how you get the Byzantines going. If we were to try and do it for the, this bit of land, we block off this, right? We block off this straight. All their armies on this side. I think you can instantly see the problem. If all their armies on this side, then, you know, they're just going to walk over and take our land. So it doesn't really work. Anyway, going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.